Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks so much for checking out the video. Um, you asked for her, you've heard about her. This is the one and only, the highly talented and extremely lovely Anna, uh, she, okay. aka Miss Mad Cat, and we're doing a tour today of her raft. So let's get started, we'll check it out. All right, we're starting here on the front of the raft, up at the house, and uh, Anna, why don't you take us through the, the front entrance here? Okay, so basically I wanted to make a nice like kitchen area. So this is the dining area, and then every cabinet has some kind of food item in it, because I thought it'd be appropriate. Um, this right here has all the tapes I've collected. You could look in there. And then um, this little, little cook pot. I really only have one of one thing, because I just wanted to make it like an actual kitchen. Um, because I'm more about the what the things look like than than the, I guess, usefulness. That's awesome. <laughs> um, yeah. Yes, yes. And then, then I guess this is where you make the juices, the smoothies. Mm -hmm. And it tells you what's in here. So I've got a few items that I can just throw uh, together and make a smoothie whenever I need it. And the nice grill. You are definitely a master of labeling. You'll notice here, everything that's in this chest here is labeled right here. Uh, <laughs> moving over to the right, she's done color coding and labeling. If you watch my tips and tricks video, you'll remember this. And it's got a lot of signs. Uh, so you'll, um, know, you'll notice what she's done with a lot of the animals there. <laughs> that's right. So all of these are really nice. That. Yeah, they're very clearly labeled and color coded. I found these in uh, random chests in different islands. That's, that's right. No animals were harmed in the making of this video. <laughs> <laughs> Previous videos, maybe, but but not this video. <laughs> All right, we'll work around exactly. to the back here and go through her main storage area. Mm. So you'll see that storage um, method is duplicated here. So there's color coding, there's general labeling up at the top, and then more detailed labeling along the sides too. So she's taken what I've done and gone another step with it as well. The peaks roofs are also really, really nice in here too. They give it a really cool effect at the top. Um, this big storage chest too, you notice she's got one of most of the regular crafting materials so she's able to hop in here and really quickly have access to a wide variety of items where you can quickly craft almost anything all right we'll head back up to the front here and go through oh, also i also oh. have this one this one chest is for the drop and go so oh I that's drop, awesome yeah in case i want to just go to an island I just drop or grab all the things i normally need and then i go but yeah I, all these like the chests like that Definitely just learn that from you with your the tips and tricks that you video that you put up. Oh, well, I really like what you did with the sideways uh, labeling as well. That works really well. Yes, cool, yes. Cool. There's a little Thank hidden you. storage cubby here too for some extras. It doubles as a jail whenever one of us is in trouble. <laughs> Good bad. <laughs> That's right. Uh, we'll head through the, the water hut here too. So she's got a whole bunch. How many uh, water refineries have you got here? Water purifiers. Um, looks like I have ten. Oh, that is that's more than I've got. I've only got four on mine. This is a huge I do facility not here. Run out of water. Yeah, yeah, she's got a lot of the advanced batteries too. And you notice the pipes all funnel into this one tank here, and it goes up and across, kind of a corridor here too. We'll get into where that goes pretty soon. All right, we'll head out to the front. And the next building right here is a forge. So why don't you take us through this one, Anna? Okay. Um, yeah. So I put these down so that I can easily make them. And then anything that I'm working on that I need to make more of, I put in these chests. So I can easily grab it. There's some more hidden chests underneath the stairs. Oh, cool. And here I just put all my, like, the trash that I don't need so I can just turn them into little trash cubes. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Oh, that's a great setup. We'll head Thank out this you. way. And we'll, we'll do the second floor uh, pretty soon. Let's head around to the back of the raft here. So this is a really cool little building. Oh, we'll fall right into the water. So this is a really cool <laughs> little building. Um, it's a two-story hut with a sleeping quarters right up here. There we go. And a really awesome element at the back here too. If you climb up this ladder, there's an awesome little desk. You can imagine yourself sitting here, jotting down all your thoughts hitting a horn for no reason <laughs> and just enjoying the incredible view out here too 
Another really cool thing about this building, if you want to get up to the, quick, the top of it really quickly, if you're having a nap, you can just stand up and boom, there you are. So if you if you have a really inspirational dream, <laughs> you could just pop up here and <laughs> jot it down right away. If you go to bed there and you wake up, you That's wake right. up up top. <laughs> That's right, you get your thoughts down right away. <laughs> yeah. All right, we'll head over to the next building here. This one might be my favorite. Uh, this was <laughs> one that, uh, that Anna actually built for me um, on her raft for whenever we were playing together. Um, it's got a great little crop plot grass area out here too. And a really cool hidden area underneath the floor. We're, we're working on that. That's still a work in progress. <laughs> I'll close that down. Um, I've never had a bath outside, but I'm sure if I did, I'd enjoy it. So that's that's a good part there too. Uh, we've got my name right there. And I love oh, yeah. what she's done with the inside. Another cool thing we just noticed is if you have a, a nap, you can actually see the clock, which is really, really cool. <laughs> so you know exactly what time it is when you wake up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's got an eating area, some photos. And the best part of the house, I think, is right around the back here. We'll head up to the top and check that out. I've got my own tiki bar. How cool is that? There's a grill right here, a few bar stools, and even a juicer on the inside. I haven't told anyone this on, on live yet, but when I was younger, I used to be a bartender. And uh, Anna built this here just for me, so I thought that was really, really cool. She did a great job with all the hanging herds. Uh... Pina colada, please, sir. Uh, coming right up, absolutely. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> oh, I dropped it. It's been a little while since I've juggled, so there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, we'll head over to, let's do the engine room. All right, look at that just from the outside, too. It looks almost like one of those, um, what are those called? The, the fairies that have got the wheels on the outside. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Looks really cool. There's the entrance. We'll head through. And look at how well done this is. I mean, even the floor is carpeted in the engine room. Just an mm -hmm. amazing touch. We'll head around to the back. And a cool little element here. When one of us is in big trouble, this is where we go here. We've become a meal for Bruce. <laughs> oh, Lord. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, I get your point. I've done enough talking. Uh, why don't you show us the top <laughs> of the uh, the engine room there? You get my point. Whew. Mm. <laughs> All right. All right. Yep. This, so I got the battery ones here. Mm -hmm. um, took me a while, but I was able to switch out all my batteries to these much, much better, bigger lasting batteries, which mm -hmm. is awesome. And then over here is where I just go to refuel. So it's quick. I can just grab my honey from here, grab my eggs. I use I use eggs because I have so many little cluckers that mm -hmm. I have just like infinite amount of eggs. So I use that for fuel. And it's like, bam, 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 put the honey and that'll last me for a while. That's an awesome design. I really like how it's easy to get into the chest and then start the uh, the biofuel process right down below too. Thank you. No more spear for you now. <laughs> All right. Well, why don't we move up to the second floor? We'll start off up here. Okay. There we go. Look at how well decorated this is, too. Just awesome. I love the white. It's very open. The lighting is great in it. I think it's, yeah, it's dark and gloomy and rainy outside, but inside here it just feels really, really cozy. Um, I've got to take a quick little break. Excuse me. <laughs> so this is the bathroom in right here too. Um, one of the it's it's nicer than the one in my house. I can tell you that she did a great job in it. The view is really nice. Um, if you got to do any computing, you got your radar right there too, and bathtub. And she did a great job with the carpeting too. Here and all the wires are hidden from the uh, from the radar too. But we'll close that. Uh, there's the the bedroom, properly labeled. Looks great. All right, we'll head out to the front here. And I think I'm back at the ground floor here. Let's um, let's go up to the second floor. And you know what? We can show off the, the garden here. Oh, okay. oh, actually, here's the helm, too. Look at how well decorated that is. All the plants. You've got, even better than a map, you've got a whole globe. <laughs> you can know exactly where you're going. All right. And I got the idea of the horn from you. Oh, right. Yeah, absolutely. Good, good. All right, so we'll head over here to the... The garden, or I guess this is more the uh, the animal pens. So mm -hmm. Anna somehow did get 
every single one of every single version of every animal. So I'm still <laughs> I'm still missing the pink clucker on my raft. Um, have you got one or two? You got one, right? Two. You have I two? two pink ones. You, you took Where's the one from my it? world, and that's why I can't find it. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> All <nice>. right. <laughs> That's so good. many friends. Yeah, but it generates a whole lot of eggs and wool and milk and everything that she needs. Mm -hmm. And everything, of course, is is watered by that hidden pipe down below. Good. She's got a great, another outdoor bathtub over here. And a really nice viewing area. Oh, this would be good for um, charades or something, hey? You want to play right here? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Um, <laughs> uh, a clucker. Yeah, clucker. That was it. You got it. <laughs> there you go. All right, and we'll head back up to the, the house here. Yeah. The chests right here are also really useful. So everything that she'll get from the llama, the cluckers, and the goats are all right there. All right, and we'll head inside to the Elton John-inspired piano room. Oh, look, your uh, your clucker matches. <laughs> oh, yeah. They always want to come in here. They obviously love how well decorated this room is. So there we go. Oh, Pinky's here. There. Got him. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. And there's curtains here, too. If you ever need to see the view. It's a lot prettier in here than it is outside right now. I can tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And we'll head up to the front. So, oh, if you've seen my video on the apiary, thank you so much for checking it out. You've got to see this. This is even better. Um, so Anna's figured out a way to clip a whole bunch of honeycombs all together. So she's got, um, how many are in here? Do you remember? Oh my goodness. Uh, It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Wow. I think that... there's 17. <laughs> Talk about space efficiency. Is space that right? Efficient. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, there's 14. Wow, 14. That, that is amazing. Um, I, I don't know how to do this, and I don't know if Anna remembers how to do this either, but it's pretty I... incredible. I did it accidentally on my raft because yeah. I was like, I was like, I was putting them down and then suddenly I was able to put one on top of the other one. And I was like, why did I do that? How did I do that? And, it and I realized, yeah, it's cause, because I have this back wall behind, mm -hmm. like, and I had to put a wall through it first. And then I was, well, you know, it's a whole thing, but I was able to then stack them and then remove the walls. And then they would just stay like that. I have That's to awesome. like really figure out how to do it and then let you know yeah. exactly. We should do another video on it. Yes. All right. And we'll head up one more level. This is another little living area. Really nicely done. Nice warm fireplace. <clears throat> and then up one more. Oh, I guess this is the outside of it too. Oh, <laughs> come on out. There we go. Um, she's got a whole bunch of fireworks too. So whenever we want to have a party, we can launch all these off and it just lights up the sky like crazy. You have to um, farm the the explosive powder. The best one is, what is it? C Cavana? C Caravan, Caravan Town. Yeah. Car yeah, Caravan Town. It just, they infinitely respawn the um, puffers. That's and right. there's like yeah. eight of them or something. Makes it quick and easy. Yeah. Awesome. And that is it. So we're at the top of the raft right now. We'll head up here. Thank you so much for checking it out. Um, you got to leave your, your comments in the, the comment section down below too. Thanks so much for checking out the video. Let me know what you thought of Anna's raft and uh, if you'd change anything or, or what you would do with a similar raft. All right, you ready to launch off a few? Yes. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks again for checking out the video, guys. Uh, comment down below what we should do next. <laughs>